what is up my crazy subscriber this is Joe King John 64 and today people I want to give you guys my first impressions on the Lawbreakers beta if you guys haven't played this game yet make sure to check out your PSN store download the game and play it and tell me how it went for you guys and what do you think about this game so far so my first impressions about this game when I jump into the game you know I want to talk about the movements the weapons the characters and all that stuff real quick uh, first things first the movements it's kind of really uncontrollable like I don't know how to explain that but I cannot control when I'm just like floating in space like I want to have a little bit of control about that but you know you gotta wait until your one of your skills recharges and of course you can control yourself in the skies and everything I don't know it's just like it's more like floating and gliding than you know pretty much quickness and movement and all that stuff like advanced warfare or infinite warfare or uh you know i really i, don't, I really don't have another game in mind to be honest uh i don't think i've played other futuristic games destiny i mean destiny i believe is a lot faster than this but in this game like everything's like you're just gliding slowly and that kind of pisses me off sometimes because for a game like this, I mean, you gotta be super quick. And yes, there's some other characters out there that are super quick too. So maybe you, want, you guys want to try that out first instead of like using the character that I'm using right now, which is pretty much of a slow character and uh, it requires a little bit more of a short distance to like kind of kill. Uh, one of the things that also that I'm kind of concerned about has to be the damage consistency. Sometimes I'll kill the enemy in an instant with no problem. I'll just start shooting them from close range and bam, you know, that guy's dead. But in other moments, there was like maybe like a person in front of me and I was barely making any damage. And the guy didn't have any kind of like shield power up or nothing. The guy was full health and everything. And I was trying to make some damage and it was barely making anything. And the guy just turns around and just, he just shoots me like with one clip or half a clip and he kills me like what the fuck is up with that like I was so pissed off I was like is there some kind of cons inconsistency going on with the damage of the weapons and they gotta check that out those devs man they gotta check out those kinds of weapon things because this is ridiculous there were so many instances and it's not it's not something that happens once in a while it happens every single match that I was in for this game so that one is my biggest concern that I have for this game has to be the damage consistency it's just inconsistent especially from short range and that cannot just happen like that man so anyways another thing that I want to talk about has to be the special abilities some of them are cool some of them are like man I guess so you know like for this character that I'm using in the background he just slams into the floor and makes some kind of damage some kind of damage and that's a special i'm kind of concerned about that because a special is supposed to be like something like whoa you know it's supposed to give you a wall factor it's supposed to surprise you right it really didn't convince me that that was a special it really it really doesn't and that shit takes like one minute to charge as you can see on my bottom left corner of my screen it's there's a timer and it's telling me how long it will take me to like recharge that special like some characters are alright but this one that I'm using and some other ones that I've seen they're not really convincing as specials they're like the, the, the lamest specials I've ever seen might as well just turning into a skill and they don't even do enough damage either so I don't know man, I just, I'm not really convinced about the specials, that has to be the most wackiest part I've ever played about this game, the specials, uh, the weapons also, the inconsistency and damage, uh, another thing, the maps, I mean, they're interesting, they're alright, you know, I'll give it like a freaking, a pass, you know, I'll give it like a 7.5 out of 10, it's decent, uh, the characters, it's like around 9 characters to choose from, or 8 characters I believe, no, it's actually 8, 8 characters to choose from, that's half of the list of Overwatch, and, you know, I don't want to compare this game to Overwatch, because, you know, they're both different from each other, but, like, um, when it comes down to characters, I don't want to feel so limited, they should have added more, Battleborn had more also on release day, so, I don't know what devs are doing do you see like look at that look, look at that the, the gameplay right now i was shooting this guy forever and the guy didn't die but i think he had a shield boost but there were some other instances too where the guy he didn't have a shield boost and i couldn't kill him at all so anyways like i was saying the character selection is quite limited i really didn't like that you know about this game there might be more coming up in dlcs but like that's dlc you gotta pay extra to get all that stuff but on release day, I mean, this is the characters that you have. You have a rocket guy, you know, with a rocket launcher only. You got two guys with grenade launchers and the rest of them with SMGs and assault rifles. Like, that's kind of a, you know, that's pretty much your list. And uh, the ones that I hated the most was the battle medic because that guy only has a grenade launcher and his backup weapon is quite decent. It's just that it has low amount of ammo. So, like, the battle medic you're barely going to use it. The rocket guy, you can only, you can, you can only use that kind of guy 
on very very tight stages uh, that have like small corridors, uh, small amount of areas, like you know tiny areas, so you can make that explosion radius work. So he is a little bit useless, and the battle medic he's a little bit useless also. So you pretty much stuck with six characters in total. So it's it's just like. I don't know, man. This, this game just doesn't, doesn't convince me at all, like in buying it. But I'll talk about it more about uh, about this game in the full review, and I'll give you guys more insight about this game. So that's it, guys. Play the game and tell me what you guys think in the comment section. So I'll see you guys later, and subscribe for more Lawbreakers.